Okay, so we're here. Um, In 300 meters. Busy round here today, so um, I'm not sure if I will get a parking space. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! It is. It's crazy. Oh man! Yeah. So um, disclaimer: I do not own the rights to this music in the car that's playing. Just want to get that clear. Um, don't own the rights to it, so just going a little afro beat. And um, yeah, so I'm not sure, I just don't know how it's so busy, and it's like 44 degrees at the minute. And there are a couple of people walking around. I'm not gonna actually show anywhere because. Just that traffic lights. <laughs> so yeah, and um, I had to kind of take the camera off the dashboard because the phone was just like, ah, I need AC, I need AC. So I may have to shut off this video real quick again. Um, was here um, because it's, it's the, the, the sun is literally like melting everything so um, yeah so if you can bear with me I will I will do my best to try and walk around and show bits and bottles but it's hot it's hot okay we're moving right and we're in gridlock traffic like some mad thing going on around here. I don't know if there's any um any stand over here. Um it just In four hundred meters, turn left onto tenth street. Ooh child. I'm gonna see if I can actually park up um in the courtyard of this this place. Um I'm gonna have to get out my reflectors because it is kind of heat. We're only, we're only, it's 11 o'clock in the morning and it's 44 degrees. So it's gonna easily hit by, by 1 p.m. We're looking at probably hitting the near 50 mark, so. Yeah, yeah, that kind of heat, baby. not a joke. Everyone's just trying to get out of the traffic. Ah. Yeah, in these times you pray for AC. Not gonna lie. Hopefully I can get, get a spot, but um, it ain't looking, it's, it's not looking promising. Oh God. Turn left onto 10th street, then turn right. Okay, I will. See if I can get. Oh dear me. Yeah, and here we drive obviously on the other side, on the opposite side. So obviously in the UK we drive on the left. Here we drive on the right. And you gotta be cheeky cheeky. Cheeky cheeky. I'm always cheeky when I'm driving. I'm always like, beep beep. Hey, thank you, bye. Um, 
<laughs> it's not always met with smiles but you know this is how it goes this is how we do right okay turn so, right then turn right uh, I'll turn right here uh, yeah I think people are just gunning for any kind of space um, and why I mean it, just gunning for any kind of space so they don't have to walk too far um, to get to Turn right a, to get to a destination that's got AC. Right, I'm actually coming away from where I'm meant to go, and in 300 meters, turn right towards 10th Street. All right, I'm going, girl. I'm going. Yeah, they're just everyone's just hitching up, man, because why? Um, right, this is where I'm driving now. I've just obviously been showing you. It's dead <laughs> because I just, I just had to go. Some next back street business because the, the traffic is absolutely crazy on the other side. So. Yeah, I turn right onto 10th Street, then turn left onto 19A Street. Yeah, I don't want to be hitting that traffic again. I know I didn't show it to you, but it's it's. Okay, so he's just got that space. Everyone's just got in for space. <laughs> oh, oh no. Go on, Mr. Taxi, quick, quick. I guess you get used to driving. See, I'm, I'm, I'm heading on. Continue for meters. Where we're driving now, we're just hitting, we're going to hit traffic. And it's going to be probably about half a kilometre worth, half a kilometre of traffic now where you're looking at the moment it's very um, much it's just warehouses and distribution and um, places and uh, not of any interest as such because a lot of trade goes on around here um, this is Alquaz this is Alquaz um, 4 so Alquaz is broken up into different little mini districts there's Alquaz 1 Alquaz 2 and so on and so forth this is Alquaz we're obviously Alquas 4 and part of Alquas 4 the um, yeah the design district which is where I'm trying to get to oh, gosh and just in front of me is the Burj Al Club um, so if I kind of drive straight down I don't think you'll be able to see it on my phone um, might be able to see a glimpse of it because it is quite a little bit overcast today but it's behind some trees <laughs> it's not the uh, yeah the Burj Al Club is um, the seven star hotel that everyone raves about and um, tries to get into which I don't know even if it's opening up to be honest I think it is actually um, so yeah um, so we're coming out of we're in between Alquaz, Industrial Estate 3 and 4, but main. Um, if you can see in the left hand part of the screen, that's the Burj Halarab, Alquad, um, which is directly in front. Not heading there <laughs> by any stretch. Um, but like I say, yeah, we're on, we're on, we're on road. We're rolling. Yes, we are. Um, so I'm going to actually shut off the camera shortly because, again, <laughs> the benefit of, the, of my phone is. Let's check the window. Oh, God, the window there. Up, 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 up. It's hot. 
and I got back up in traffic. And the thing is, there's a there's a saying here in Dubai that people tend to, or drivers tend to beep 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 beep. They have no reason, because no everyone's going the same direction. But the fact is that they're impatient. They're bonding up in their cars. If their AC is lock off, they might burn up fire, fire, fire. So with that, they might go, beep, beep, come on, move it. So just saying, um, it's kind of relaxed around here actually. I don't, I've not been bipped at yet. Have done in the past, because obviously driving in a new country and getting familiar with the um, surroundings can be a bit tricky, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so I, I think I'd better do a talk about that as well, um, driving in Dubai. Yeah, I'll do a talk about that another time because it, it ain't... Just put it this way, it's not as straightforward as you think. So it's a skill that you have to learn quite quickly, very quickly. And once you've got the grip of it once that muscle memory kicks in you're good like it took me all of about three weeks to get used to the roads but for those of you who know me anyway I am just all about yeah get me in get me get me in this situation get me on the road first and foremost I just got to be on the road um, and I'm, I'm, I'm gone I'm, I'm just driving so and I do love driving um, I prefer driving in and out of cities. I like the kind of the thrill, the risk, you know, those long distance driving things. Nah, it's not me. I just fall asleep. And also, it just, yeah. I like my brain to be alert and active and, you know, looking out for danger spots and things like that. When I'm d driving on a long distance, all that makes me want to do is just go into meditation mode where it's you know it's relaxing but I'm like pew, 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 pew. yeah that for those who know me you know all right so listen guys I'm just gonna switch off because I need to cool down the camera and um, yeah I'll see you shortly <laughs>